Judge Napolitano drops Vegas hotel bombshell. Las Vegas Metropolitan Police are working around the clock to iron out an official timeline of events related to the Las Vegas shootings. Fox News senior judicial analyst Judge Andrew Napolitano suggests that the Mandalay Bay Resort and Casino had knowledge of an active shooter in their hotel six minutes before Stephen Paddock launched the deadliest mass shooting in recent American history, reports Fox News. On Sunday, October 1st, Nevada resident Stephen Paddock opened fire from the 32nd floor of the Mandalay Bay Resort and Casino onto 22,000 country music fans attending the Route 91 Music Festival. The tragic shooting left 58 dead and over 200 wounded. The Las Vegas Metropolitan Police Department was, has remained accessible to the public as details of the shooting emerge and they are continually updating an official timeline of events. Now MGM Resorts International, the company that owns the Mandalay Bay, is questioning the latest timeline released by LVMPD Sheriff Joe Lombardo. According to the original timeline, Stephen Paddock opened fire on the Route 91 Festival at 10.05 p.m. and had ceased shooting by 10.15 p.m. Police identified that shots were coming from the Mandalay Resort by 10.08 p.m. and officers arrived on the 31st floor at 10.12 12 p.m. when they announced the gunfire is coming from directly above them as Las Vegas police were stationed on the 32nd floor by 10.17 p.m. and found Jesus... Jesus uh, Campos at 10 18 p.m. Campos, a security guard at Mandalay Bay, was responding to an unrelated alarm on the 32nd floor where, when Paddock opened fire on the unsuspecting security guard. Paddock fired around 200 rounds into the hallway. Only one bullet stu uh, struck Campos in the leg. Police found Campos in an elevator at 10.18 p.m. when Campos told police which room Paddock was hiding in. Police originally assumed Campos was shot sometime between 10.05 and 10.15 p.m. However, at a press conference on Monday, Sheriff Lombardo updated the official timeline. Now police believe that Campos was shot at 9.59 uh, p.m., six minutes before Paddock commenced his killing spree. This remains an ongoing investigation with a lot of moving parts as evidenced by law enforcement briefings over the past week. Many facts are still unverified and continue to change as events are under review, explained Deborah DeShong, a spokesperson for MGM Resorts. We cannot be certain about the uh, most recent timeline that has been communicated publicly, and we believe that it, what current, is currently being expressed may not be accurate, she said, casting doubt on the latest police timeline. The LVMPD maintain that the latest timeline reflects the information they have available but is subject to change since the investigation is still ongoing. According to Judge Napolitano, the changes to the timeline could be damning for MGM Resorts. Judge Napolitano suggests that MGM knew they had an active shooter in the building yet failed to inform the police. The news is that the agent of the hotel, who should have been car uh, carrying with him a recording device, a device which uh, would have allowed the head of security or somebody in security to listen in, was shot at 200 times by an automatic weapon. So Mandalay Bay knew of the existence and presence and workability of the automatic weapon six minutes before he started killing people. That should have triggered an enormous response, Judge Napolitano said. The truth will come out as the facts present. Six minutes is an adequate amount of time for law enforcement and security to respond to such an event. Nevertheless, no matter what the facts expose, this event remains a significant tragedy, absolutely. Uh, let me know what you guys think in the comments below, and again, thank you so much for watching.